Hey, good morning to you. Yeah. Oh, what a marvelous weekend, eh? Yeah. Um. I hope you managed to get out and uh, ride your bike. If you didn't, I mean, I thought I. I went out with Mrs. Tame on Sunday. No cameras involved, of course. Well, apart from Mrs. Tame's camera, who was busy taking pictures of plants. Yeah, plants of all things. Yeah, marvellous. Um, yeah, the, uh, I mean, this week, though, the weather's grey, windy and rainy. Yeah, so I don't even know if I'll make Two Wheel Tuesday. Hopefully the weather will clear up just for Tuesday evening. Yeah. Um, the videos, yeah. The Himalayan video. I hope you enjoyed that. Just a quick look. Obviously couldn't do a lot because it had no miles on it at all when I when I was there. Um, and it probably won't do for a while. Um, but yeah, uh, a cracking little bike but with some flaws and some reservations it's going to be a rivy bike you're going to have to keep it above three or four thousand in fact a couple of people noticed it looking well yeah it caught me by surprise if you're not down low enough and getting those revs up um uh, the flickering screen of course everyone mentioned and you know put it onto night mode it gets brighter and stuff like that um, well, the only ones I've had where you can change the screen, they do it automatically. Bit of a pain, isn't it, if you have to change it yourself. Just my thoughts. A cracking bike, not sure how much power it's really going to have compared to the Triumph. I'm just not. Um, would I like one? Yes, I would. As I said, cracking bike. Uh, would I prefer the Triumph? I think for every day, scooting about, doing a bit of adventuring, I think either would do, but I do like the Triumph. Uh, it, yeah, uh, much lighter. The Himalayan does feel heavy, I've got to say. It feels heavier than the 200 kilos even, that they say. But there you go, that's that. And then, of course, the other video... Um, uh, the Wolves of St Edmunds yeah just something different uh, initially I did it just for Rob yeah to show Rob and Rob saw it ages ago um, yeah I, I like doing little odd videos like that as you know I did Family Nome Castle and I've done a few little things um, but I might do one or two more I don't know uh, but of course they don't get a huge amount of views which is fine uh, but talking on that line before I get on to photos um, uh, yeah gone at 7,000 subscribers I forgot what I was going to say then yeah 7,000 subscribers can you believe it uh, just incredible um, can't thank you all enough uh, I must be doing something along the right lines, I think. Uh, keeping you lot entertained. Keeping you in trouble with your missus, yeah. Uh, I guess someone's got to. Um, then, uh, before I get onto photos as well, the DGR. Yeah, last time I mentioned it, uh, had a little bit of a spurt on with donations. I'll always take more donations if you're uh, able and willing uh, it'd be really good uh, I've also amassed some stickers and badges and so on badges and stuff like that and I'm just wondering whether hog whether I can I can't raffle them off but the laws about giving stuff away I don't know um, it's got to go to someone deserving so I mean there are some of you who have donated huge amounts of money and I feel like I should send it to maybe one of you not sure but uh, if I can think of a way of making more money from it uh, that'd be great if you've got any ideas let me know uh, right finally let's get on to photos and straight off my mate Charlie you know Charlie uh, 
he he hasn't sent us a picture of his bikes none of his bikes no but I will get back to that in a minute um, he was out and he saw his mate and he's done this little video look at this yeah I might just cut it in If I have, I've done it now. If I haven't, it's still running. Yeah, AJS uh, 1946, oh, 1946, I want to say. AJS, listen to that. Paid two and a half grand for it. He's only just bought it. Absolutely marvellous. Uh, yeah, wonderful. Uh, then what did I get? Um, uh, TR, yeah, or oh, the what's his real name, the pipe smoking beekeeper, or something like that. I think if I had bees, I'd smoke a pipe as well to keep them away from me. Yeah, uh, he's been out on his new classic 350 in Godly Green. Yeah, isn't that marvellous? Absolutely wonderful. Um, uh, yeah, I forgot where I was going then. I've got, I've got this car come racing up behind me and I sort of think I ought to let him go. But never mind. Um, then what do we get? Oh, Mel. Mel's been out cutting his grass. Look at this. Yeah, <laughs> that's marvellous. What a fantastic seat to have in your garden. Wonderful, that little Vespa or scooter, whatever it is. What else could you do with half a scooter that's had its day? I don't know. Marvellous. Uh, then PB sent us a couple of great photos. He said it's the... Oh, um, the Marx Brothers, except uh, he called them... Um, oh, what was it? The... <laughs> I, can't, I, can't, I can't remember. Um, the Curtain Stink Wheelers Gang, something like that. But there's Oily, Grubby and Finger, yeah, on a, a sash, yeah, is that how you pronounce it? I couldn't even remember. Um, yeah, a sash, uh, MV Augusta, look at that, wonderful uh, classic motorbike. Um, uh, and uh, what was it? A TRK. TRK was the next one, wasn't it? Yeah, marvellous bikes, marvellous chaps, up for a laugh, brilliant. Also got a photo from TC. Yeah, TC sent us a picture uh, of his first bike. Look at that, 1978 Puck Monza, Spanish made. Yeah, brilliant. I remember them. Yeah, there were one or two about. 50 mile an hour plus yeah when 50cc motorbikes were a thing at 16 and you couldn't get them doing crazy speeds like the fizzy and the ap50 and the fantic gran turismo marvelous bikes I also got a photo from warthog ages ago thought i'd done it obviously haven't um of merlin the thruxton on the Isle of Man there with the Isle of Man statue you know the three legs oh, it's got a name can't remember it <laughs> yeah typically um, then what do I get oh Chris W he says a blast from the past look at that uh, RD 250 1978 RD 250 uh, he, 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 said, he said it is a wonderful bike they are a wonderful bike yeah absolutely marvellous um, and of course if you, you'll remember in one of the other mutters that we had the Lavenham giraffe posh Lavenham posh giraffe do you remember it well Richie says oh look at that coincidence the day that came out he was out on tour he also reminded me that he's almost retired yeah marvellous thanks for that Richie makes me feel brilliant yeah wonderful 
Um, but everyone's getting new bikes. Uh, and my mate Jay is had that wonderful Bonneville, and uh, what was it? Was it a Honda Twin? Um, well, he's gone and got himself an Interceptor. Yeah, look at that, marvelous, and what great pictures. Yeah, of the the gun, the cannon. Absolutely, talk about built like a gun. Wonderful. Uh, I've still got a lot of photos to get through, and I'm gonna I'm, so I'm gonna get now to uh, Jeff L. Yeah, um, he said he's been out. He said bike meets have started, and he sent us this picture. There's a Suzuki in the foreground and the bike meet in the background, um, and then a picture of the Z650. Wonderful. Um, yeah, bike bike meets have started, but the weather is playing havoc with them, isn't it? Yeah, and bad news on Ston and Barnes, I'll tell you about that shortly. Uh, then, to, as we're on with Jeff, let's get on to Rob Little. He sent us a picture. He said, here, here's four Roberts. <laughs> here's for four, four Roberts, two learners, and one pristine, fastidiously clean, Herald. Yeah, excellent. Brilliant photos. Thanks, Rob, um, and thanks for your support with uh, the Wolves of Bury St Edmunds and for giving me the inspiration. Uh, then what have we got? Uh, let's get through here first. Um, oh, AP, he's been out and about and he said, look at this, I found this uh, chitty chitty bang bang. Yeah, because there are a number of them, apparently, lying around. Uh, old git there, hiding behind the car. Um, yeah, chitty chitty bang bang, but also a Volvo P1800. Uh, morning giraffe, yeah, Volvos, eh? Oh, he thought I said Volvo. I don't know what's up with him. Um, it was the sun's got to him. What's this bloke doing? I don't know. There's a pelican crossing there, mate. Um, yeah. Oh, fantastic photos. Uh, then what do I get? Uh, MP. Oh, he's out in the Algarve. He said, and he came across this rather splendid looking uh, Vespa. Yeah, wonderful. What a lovely blue. Um, but also, uh, they came across this. Uh, he said, uh, give my regards to the old git in Bury St Edmunds. Yeah, look at that old tree, gnarly, grumpy tree stump yeah in the Algarve at least he's got sun yeah marvellous um, then what have I got oh I am not really going to get through all these photos uh, TCB or oh, went on about flat tyres I'm not going to go into great detail on it but he got home on his Speedmaster and that's what he found yeah can you believe that he said I can't believe anybody has tube tyres anymore he said he's had a number of flat tyres and repaired them all himself yeah to get home at the side of the road he said punch a repair kit and an inflator yeah wonderful um, then what do we get uh, JG yeah he sent us a picture of whole oh, giraffes <laughs> of those giraffes but also I'll go around Bury again because you did enjoy that last time and I might even go a slightly different route I don't know if it's open I will yeah um, uh, JG yeah uh, he was on about tigers as well look at these tigers he found while he was out on the uh, on the uh, uh, Jemima yeah the classic 350 wonderful um, oh that's not open I wonder why that's not open never mind um, uh, oh, then what do we get oh yeah uh, is uh, Jemima classic 350 wonderful or oh, naughty boys did you see that a load of naughty boys marvelous well, they're going off in all directions. Um, SC, 
uh, another new bike yeah look at that nc 750x a bike i have seriously considered and continue to seriously consider yeah wonderful um very lucky chap i hope you have many happy adventures on that this uh, summer and in fact uh in next summer as well yeah wonderful uh then what do we get oh td Um, up in North Yorkshire, yeah, up in North Yorkshire, um, uh, uh, cloudy day, he was out, he was out looking for a sunset, he said it clouded over, he said and now he's grumpy, <laughs> yeah, out on his super meteor, how can you be grumpy when you're out on a super meteor in God's own country, I don't know, uh, marvellous, and lastly, something I, I just want to mention, IT, you know IT down in New Zealand he sent us um, a link uh, to a YouTube channel a New Zealand YouTube channel about a T100 absolutely marvellous go and have a look at it uh, links in the bottom it's called Wesley James yeah so if you can't get access to the link uh, just search YouTube for Wesley James and I will uh, catch you in Friday's Mutter I hope you have a fantastic week and ride careful uh, yeah and I'll catch you in uh, Friday's Mutter ta-ta